welcome to support this TV and damn it, but please subscribe and hit that notification bell so you can know when I'm dropping these vids. This is not an endorsement, but shout out to soulcollector.com. I use their website as a reference for this video, but let's get to it. Now, this may come to a surprise to most of you, but Skechers earned more than 4.64 billion in revenue during 2018. I remember when there was a time where wearing Skechers was not cool. I remember when 310 Motoring, a lot of y'all probably remember 310 Motoring. 310 Motoring was a custom car company out of LA. They went by the area code at the time, 310. And every time you seen music videos, you seen 310. People borrowed cars, rented cars, bought cars from 310. 310 had a deal with Skechers. And when 310 deal with Skechers, they made shoes. They had some shoes. And I saw those shoes. They used to call it the perfect driving shoe. And I was like, oh, man, these shoes are cool. But I did not like the fact they were made by Skechers. I might sound very retarded. But I was like, I don't want them because they made by Skechers. Then they did a deal with Game. Well, Game came out with some shoes called the Hurricane. These were through 310 through Skechers. They was the middleman for Game having a shoe deal, and they were called Hurricane. And I remember seeing those shoes, and I was like, uh, I don't know. Game was red hot at the time. Game had just came off selling 5 million records. If you are a fan of Game and you don't hear Game music, Game reminds you that he sold 5 million records on his first album. So Game was hot. They had, like, look promos for this shoe. They had did a whole lot of stuff for this shoe. And the next thing I know, they went from promoting it to you not even hearing about it no more. Once it got around, like, 2008, you didn't even hear about 310 no more. You know, that got to the point I didn't even hear about Skechers no more. So I was very shocked when I seen Skechers posted $4 billion last year in earnings for last year. Skechers was doing their thing. I guess back at them times, Skechers was just trying some shit. Because I don't know if y'all remember, Nas had a shoe at one time. Yeah, Nas had a shoe one time. Okay, Nelly had a shoe at one time. I don't know if y'all remember that. Birdman had to deal with Lux. I don't know. I think Birdman deal with Lux still going on. Do Lux, is Lux still around? I don't know. Lux gonna be one of those ones that you know you don't know is around until they post a big number. You're like, damn, they still make those too? You know. Um, but hurricanes came around that time where everybody had an ugly ass shoe. G Unit had an ugly shoe. Master P had an ugly shoe. You know, um, it was a lot of ugly shoes running around around that time, man. You know, the, 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 the Nile shoe was all right, but them Hurricanes, man, I don't know, man. I couldn't get down with the Hurricanes, even though I was a big game fan, you know, but I was still a little young and I don't know. I decided to do this video and be like, what happened to the Hurricane? What happened to game signature shoe? You know, I know sales was terrible, but why does it never talk about them no more? I don't even hear interviews with game even mentioning these shoes like it never even happened. But, you know, you can still find these shoes on sale, man. A lot of them shoes that were discontinued and no longer make. A lot of times, you can still find them online, man. Somebody still got some selling them. Or somebody probably don't remade them motherfuckers and selling them. But I am, a.k.a. Benz, support this TV. Like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. I'm out. Peace.